Welcome to Premath. In this video tutorial, we are going to simplify this given rational expression that involves mixed factorials. And here is our question. 10 factorials times 11 double factorial divided by 8 factorial times 9 double factorial. Before we proceed, let me just go over the basic review. And here's the basic rule. We have a, for example, over here, five factorial. When we have a single factorial, then when we multiply these number, our common difference is just one. So that means if we have a single factorial, then the difference is just one. When we have a double factorial, then our common difference is going to be as you can see over here. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's our very first thing. Let's focus on this first number 10 factorial. And here I have just copied down 10 factorial and this could be written as 10 times 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2 times one and we also know that we can write this 10 factorial as let's focus on this part 8 onward this 8 times 7 times 6 5 4 3 2 1 could be written as 8 factorial isn't it so therefore i can write this 10 factorial as a little bit differently 10 times 9 times 8 factorial. All right, just keep in your mind. This is what we needed. And now let's focus on 11 double factorial. And here I have just copied down 11 double factorial. And this could be written as 11 times 9 times 7 times 5, 3, and 1, because their common difference is 2. And now let's focus on this 9 onward to this one. This could be written as 9 double factorial. So therefore, I can write 11 double factorial as 11 times 9 double factorial. Just keep in your mind. Now let's go ahead and simplify our given a problem right now. Let's focus on this 10 factorial. I'm going to replace it by this one. So I can write this 10 factorial equal to 10 times 9 times 8 factorial and then times. Let's focus on our 11 double factorial and here 11 double factorial I can write as 11 times 9 double factorial and divided by I'm going to leave this denominator as it is I'm going to leave it 8 factorial times 9 double factorial all right now we can see that this 8 factorial and this 8 factorial they cross out likewise this 9 double factorial and this 9 double factorial they are gone so we are ended up with 10 times 9 times 11 and if we multiply that is going to give us 990 and that's our final answer and here's our 990 is our final simplified answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.